Hello, this is Mr. Evil Cheese, and this is just an update on the Walking Dead Series 8 action figures by McFarlane Toys. You know, they were the one that I did a video on just recently where they gave the hints by showing an accessory that was supposed to come with each character, and you're supposed to guess who they are. Well, they revealed them all, except for one. But the, the one they didn't reveal is pretty damn obvious. So, I'm going to tell you who they are. And uh, once again, I found out first about this earlier today on the Walking Dead action figure and memorabilia page. If someone on that page seen the uh, Clark Toys had them up on their website for pre-order, of course they post it on the page and then everybody gets to see. So that's why I say you should go join that page if you want to know the news when it first comes out. So the first clue was an AK-47 and that belongs to Rick and that would be most likely from the episode where he's escaping Terminus. He comes with an AK-47, a pistol, and a wooden stake. In case there's any the vampires running around in the middle of these zombies. It sounds pretty cool. I'm assuming he's going to have his brown jacket. Hopefully it's removable. That'd be cool. I do like the jacket. If it's not, then that's okay. But it'd just be cool to be removable. The riot gear helmet belongs to Eugene. And he also comes with a pistol and a backpack. And I assume that means he's dressed in riot gear. So that's cool. I was hoping for Eugene. I'd kind of rather him be in his regular clothes, but... Eh, still, a Eugene's a Eugene. And as most people guessed, the walking stick belongs to Morgan. And he also comes with an assault rifle, an alternate masked head, which I was hoping for, and a backpack. So that's really awesome. Finally getting a Morgan figure. And the already announced Dale comes with a hat, a lawn chair, binoculars, and rifle. I'm kind of excited about the lawn chair. <laughs> I don't know why. I just want a little lawn chair accessory. That'd be awesome. My original guess for the machete was Rick, until I seen somebody say something about Bob having one, and then his machete looked more close to the preview picture, and I kind of changed my guess to Bob. And it is Bob. And he comes with two machetes, a removable leg, and a barbecue foot. And I'm very happy about that, and I think everybody probably will be, because as soon as anybody had an idea that there might be a Bob figure, it's like, he's got to have a removable leg or something. Or at least his cooked leg, and it's got both. I don't know why it's got two machetes, though. But, eh, why not? Now, the last clue was that big-ass rifle, and um, that was the one that Carol used to save everybody from Terminus. But uh, it's not completely sure that it's Carol, because it could also be Noah. Because Noah, remember, he stole the gun from them for a short period of time. But uh, I'm guessing it's Carol. And I'm thinking the reason that they're not shown revealing her yet is because I'm, she's probably going to be like a Walgreens exclusive or something like that. Because it's basically probably going to be the same sculpt and everything. It's just going to have different accessories like that gun and the maybe the poncho or whatever she's wearing in different paint obviously to make her all bloodied and muddied up to look like a zombie so that's probably why she's gonna they haven't showed her yet and she'll probably be a Walgreens exclusive that's my guess they have also revealed what the katana was for the 10 inch figure and it everybody was like saying oh maybe it's the governor it's probably the governor throwing well yeah it, maybe they would do that but my guess was it was Michonne I was assuming I'd say like 95% I was pretty sure it would be Michonne. I mean, they could have been throwing a curveball, but I didn't think so. But yep, it's been confirmed basically by Clark Toys putting it up for pre-order. And it doesn't really say anything on there in a description. It just says Michonne 10-inch. So, of course she's going to come with a sword, but no idea what outfit or what the pose is going to be like yet. That might all be revealed this coming week or weekend or whatever doing Toy Fair. Hopefully, they will all be revealed, at least like the scans and everything. That'd be cool. So I think it's pretty weird that they don't have a zombie. Like, I think that was the thing that was really kind of throwing me off, was I was almost thinking the machete could have been that zombie that um, fell down and cut it, cut her face open, trying to get it, uh, what's his name, um, Father Gabriel, as he's escaping through the floor. But man, there's no zombie in this wave. The, uh, what is it, 7.5 figures as a zombie, that flu walker. So I don't know if they're counting that as a zombie or 
I mean, I guess there's no rule they have to have a zombie in every series. I just, I just expected it because there hasn't been a series without one so far. Also, the uh, Walking Dead comic series four has some new pictures, and you finally get to see a picture of the pincushion zombie, and he looks awesome. Seeing that pincushion zombie with all them weapons stuck in him is amazing. <laughs> There's actually a better view of Jesus, too. He looks a little cooler in this picture. And Carl, and... It's about the same for Abraham. He doesn't look too much different from the last preview picture. But it's still really cool. I will probably do a separate preview video for the new Walking Dead building sets. Because a couple have been shown recently, like the uh, Woodbury truck. And the um, prison catwalk. that comes with Herschel, and the truck comes with Shumpert. And uh, there's also Dell's RV and a, a few others, so I'll probably make a video for them at some point in the future. Well, all that news is really awesome, and I'm sure there's going to be some more coming up this week. Probably some more pictures to look at. Maybe I'll post another video. Well, yeah, if we get some pictures of Series 8, I'll definitely post some pictures. Maybe whoever finally wins that Series 9 vote will be revealed. I don't know. It's probably Beth. If not, Lori. But, yeah. This is with G. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Oh, damn it, man! You see them other pictures there? Why don't you click on one of them to see the video? Or you can subscribe to Nate. Oh, damn it!